be overgrown, that's a problem. In winter you can clearly see the bunker, mm -hmm. and you can see the top, but we're not finished yet. And the older ones learn English from the soldiers. So they were black market, they want to sell the stuff for cigarettes and, and chocolate. So they went to the, to the British and to the American sector and they traded cigarettes and photo cameras and watches and stuff like that. For the purpose of that bunker was uh, to observe the road, because that was the main road from um, east to west, come on that road to get to the Ruhrgebiet, the, where the steel factories were. And um, the only purpose was not to observe the road, but it was also to blow up the bridge and the road. So there was a, a kind of installation inside of that bunker that uh, allows you to put a charge in and then ignite the charge and then we have the whole bridge and road so that nobody can pass. With the, with the yeah, it's a uh, fire. Yeah. It's number J32, that's a magazine number. Mm -hmm. And the date of production is. So is that for the site? Lift in. Is, no, it's two. 1809. All oh, right. 1809. Wow. 1809. That's the caliber, 69. And that's 81. Wow. <coughs> These were original on the top of the, uh, on the, on the other side of the fort, where I said you were, the, oh, where yeah. they stored the cannonballs on it. Yes. On that brick bit on top, we have uh, this cannonball uh, place. Yeah, it's hard to. 18 something, 1 8. Yeah, 1 8, but they are. Nearly the same age. Yeah. It's the same type of gun. Wow. Yeah, that's a bit older. That's J006, and that's 32. So they are close together. Yeah. That are guns you would never find on a chip. <laughs> so heavy. Yeah, that's 81 pounds. One bullet. 81 wow. pounds. That's 42 kilograms. 81. Kilogram. You'd know if that hit yeah. you. 40, 48 kilograms. Yeah. No, that, no, sorry. That's 69, caliber 69. That's 69 kilogram per ball. Yeah. Uh, 69 pounds per ball. That's 30, 35. 35 pound. Per ball. 35 kilogram. Kilogram. See, some of the British tanks in the Second World War fired four pounder shells. Yeah, four pound. And they used to just bounce off the panzers. They were just useless. Yeah, yeah but with, with a shell like that, I guess yeah. it will. Oh, so it's tank. Everything. <laughs> tank yeah. smasher. Yeah. Heavy artillery back in that time. Yeah. 1809, that was the time when Napoleon yeah. was here. They were knocking them out in 1809, and we were. 1809, sorry. So, that was the accommodation blocks. Yes. They um, put a museum inside it. And it goes underground, it's really interesting, museum, really, really, really yeah. good. But I don't know if it's open tomorrow or not, but that is really a nice, it's a Prussian, Royal Prussian Museum with weapons. Wow. Um, um, night stuff, swords, blades, all kinds of historical stuff, really nice one. And all the area is museum and there's a small bit on the left side where some uh, room for students who mm. study Prussian history and stuff like that in there. Yeah. Uh, they use the old accommodation block and at the top there was the officer's mess. Yeah. Oh yeah. And on the right side uh, there was the mess for the for the lower lower soldiers, for yeah. the lower ranks. Yeah. There's another building. That's uh, the, the office building and and chief of staff building. In this building there was a, a kitchen and bakery. See that all Bäckerei. Yeah, Bäckerei. Number about 
also 1809. Yeah. Yeah, that's the bakery for the bread and food. There's an ice cellar underneath that yeah. where they store the vegetables. Yeah. They put big blocks of ice wow. inside and then they store the fresh stuff. Yeah. Was this was this wall then? Because I see a big like wall there. The, the, the what? Wall. It, was it walled? Yeah, that's a, everything was inside that wall. There was yeah. no bridge, there was no, no road. Yeah. That was one circular, circular bit. And outside of that, there was a rectangular um, uh, wall. And with these star-shaped outer positions with guns. Yeah. And this, uh, the outer, uh, this is the outer wall. Yeah. And after that, there comes the moat. We can, I can show you that. Behind that building, there's the outer wall, and then there's the moat. And that's the only bit what's left still originally intact. That's the commander chief building. Then you can see here. That is also. Yeah. So this was a Cleveshire regiment. Cleaver or the Cleaver is a city up. The, near the Dutch border and the Klevish regiment that was a field artillery mm -hmm. regiment number 43 seine Ausstellung seine Ausstellung von 1819 bis 1899 waren wir stationiert they were stationed from 1899 to 1919 also during the first world war yeah. and on the other side good yeah. shot wounds That's uh, 1860 to 1990. Infantry Regiment Herzog Ferdinand von Braunschweig, Dritte Westfälische Nummer 57. That was um, also heavy artillery regiment. And here are some points where they fought. König Grätz, yeah, big, big fight against the French, mm -hmm. 1870 71. Vivian, Mars, Latour, the French cities, 1860 to 66. The French French German Wars and First World War. 1940-1980, Lüttich, Pienton, Lobé, mm. Marne, the Marne plane, yeah. you know. And uh, these are all the stations where this unit was has served. There's some remembering. It's quite old, that's not new, that's yeah. made in 1919. Mm -hmm. And they were also stationed. This barracks. So. 1960-1919, Infanterieregiment Vogel von Falkenstein, 7. Westfälische Nummer 56. 7. ist 7th Army. This was the 5th. Yeah. This is 7th Army. Number 56. 56 is the battalion number. So, the same, same French-German war. Yeah. And this one had fought in Verdun. Really hard fights. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And there's another, that's, um, that's the Marine, former um, Marine soldiers. They have um, a, a place to met and to, to speak and it's a Marine Bund, German Marine mm -hmm. Bund. That's German Navy soldiers. Okay. So they can meet up and talk about the war and talk about their career. Okay. So that was the original door. That was the door. So the gun position outside, they had a, a shooting position yeah. to defend the gate where we went, where we go straight away. And now that's a museum, Schil Kasematte, that's, that's a place called Schil Kasematte, this bit. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, I'll show you the rest. You can see like bullet, bullet holes in the walls. These are the big hinges for a big door. Yeah. And here we have the original gates. These are from 1809. These are original wood, wooden gates from 1809. You can see that, you can feel that these are all original rivets and nails. Yeah. It is handcrafted. Interesting uh, fact. Why is that why is that hole on the left and on the right side? Yeah. I don't know. You can put the oil 
control yeah. or something in there. Yeah. And when they are about to break into the door, they light it up and then uh, oh. that was it. They left you in this slits ah. with yeah. the guns. Yeah. So yeah. when you come from that door, there was another uh, another wooden door on that frame. These were originally for the lights. Yeah. Originally to torches, what we call a torch. Yeah. <laughs> so that's was that's not original. No. There was a drawbridge. Yeah. And that's the boat. Uh, the boat. You can see that it's star shaped on the edges. Yes. Yeah. yeah, that's no longer existing. Go to the drawbridge where we can see that a bit better. That says about it means constructed 1718 and uh, renewed, re 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 renovated oh, right. 1823. Wow. Yeah. That was great. It was kept because in because of Napoleon. The they wall that would have been enclosed all the way down like with this wall. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that's, that's yeah. a complete that would closed been, area. That would have been wow. Oh, yeah. It was massive, massive. Yeah. It's impressive. And with, the, with that mode. Yeah. yeah. That mode here. Yeah. It's a double mode. Yeah. Yeah, we can do yours. That was the first mode. Yes. So they came over here. So, oh, there's a little bit of water. That's no problem. Yeah. So they went down that. And then was another brick wall. Yeah. Yeah. It was originally a bit higher, it was about three meters high. Okay. So they jumped over that wall and then went down and the other moat was filled with water. Yeah. yeah. Up to the top. Uh -huh. Right. So there was no chance to walk no. over that. No. So they had no chance and like go back or drink mm. uh, drown, drown in the water yeah. or oh. die and that's it. So and there were gun positions in that slit. Yes. Uh, you can see that that, that round-shaped wall. Yeah. Yes. These uh, uh, stones that are whitish. Yeah. So that's not original. It was reconstructed after the war. There were slits inside for guns. Ah. So you could gun, fire you the first mode, yeah. pick and them off the second mode, and there was a uh, the only way to enter that position is with a bridge. They had a second draw bridge on top of that. Uh -huh. So if they yeah. would enter that bit, they could not get to that so. because they could cut the draw bridge. Yeah. And that's it. So there was no chance to get on the on the main walls. Yeah. So that's the original gate. I can show you pictures tomorrow we will do that more tomorrow. Some pictures I will research that in the, in the today yes. in, the, in the late uh, evening. Um, the black and white pictures where you can see the totally destruction of that city, totally bombed to ru rubbish, but this gate was not destroyed. Right. So that was like a symbol. Yeah. And the yeah. only way to enter the city back in the days mm. were through this gate. Right. So it was quite... Mm. It's, when you t look at that picture and you, you see the history behind that, mm. it's... Uh, you can only put your hand on your heart. <laughs> mm. So you say, yeah. wow, that's history. Yeah, real history. 1740, 1714 is long ago. Yeah. And mm. there, there was Napoleon, there was the Second World War. The, the First World and War and the First World War, yeah, okay. Yeah. First World War was no problem because there was no no enemy on yeah. German, the, the yeah. German soil, but yeah. Second World War, that's the only thing the British could not destroy. Yeah. There is a lot of bomb damage on the other side, mm. but it's quite okay. It looks nice. It does. Hmm. The only thing that was is the same is the crown on top. It's not the original crown. Ah, uh. it's a rebuilt one. Yeah. And the uh, biggest shame is we have uh, two uh, Kaiser Friedrich and Kaiser Wilhelm. Wilhelm, yeah. Yeah, and there were two big statues made of bronze. Ah, in sitting in these alcoves. Alcoves, and they were uh, stolen during no. the World War. Oh. Oh. Stolen, not really, but uh, yeah. Yeah. we it's have exactly. to make guns or guns of it. And ah. ah, so 
<laughs> oh, bronze. Yeah, there are some special things on the board. There are slits on the lower side, on the lower level. Oh yeah, I never noticed those. Mm. Yeah, the slits. Through that lower Just slit. There, that vertical mm. slit. Yeah. And, uh, There's a door. Oh yeah. Where normally is no door because mm. the mold is flooded. Yes. But inside that chamber, that was a water sealed door, watertight. There's a double door. You can see that from the inside. Mm. Behind that was the power chamber, the, the the chamber for the black powder. Oh yeah. Yeah. They stored the powder in that yeah. chamber. So in the case of an emergency, if there was a fire or something like oh, that. Yeah. <laughs> they, they smashed in the door yeah. and the whole black powder magazine was was unused was useless yeah. Yeah. but if the enemy would come inside it was ah. useless yeah so yeah. all the other ways it was secured if there's a fire yes so clever clever idea yeah this was be another feature of that you could go inside there from the inside and there was this gate was inside that yeah. and you could uh, throw things from there here. Uh, uh. Like sticky bombs and uh, uh. Yeah. stuff like that and or shoot from that angle. Yeah. And it's hard to shoot back between uh, you know Oh yeah, to get into that aperture yeah, is a lot harder than them harder firing than, out. Than to throw things around the corner. Yeah. 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 Absolutely. Yeah, that's it. You can go to the to the boat area on the left. Yeah. left. So it was a really good defensive position. Yes. These windows are added later. It was originally was, uh, was inside on all sides. Yeah. Ah, uh, oh, right. Yeah. They've been built in afterwards. These were added when they built the museum. Right. And this here also. They were all, all, all sides were these slits. And these uh, these things like we can put burning stuff inside. Them away from enter that. As I said, the gate is original, it was never broken. There you can see how big it was. That's big. Mm. With all the defense lines, right. all the moats. Mm. You can yeah. see that. That is the all building we are now. Right. They take that as uh, to measure out how big it was. And on the other side of the Rhine is the rest of the fortification, oh. where we were yeah. with the close, you know, uh, I showed you where the, where the guns mm. was. That was the central bastion, and the whole city was surrounded by gun positions and moats and fortifications. The whole city areas yeah. was full of that. So that's what it looked before Second World War. And now there's nothing left, nothing, except from that bit where we're standing mm. now, this small green bit, that's it. Yeah. It's a shame. It is a shame, yeah, a massive shame. Forever. Yes. Nobody can bring that back. Mm. Yeah, it's like a hedgehog. Bruh. Yeah. Oops, sorry. <laughs> Should I translate that? Yes. Yes, please. Okay. Um, I think there's a... I don't know how to, how to explain it. I would start from the beginning. Um, there were students who are not... Uh, who don't want to have the war. Yeah. The um, Napoleon War. Okay. And they will come to this this barracks here and uh, say no, we don't want the war and blah and blah and blah. And they um, have then said we want it not, we don't want that. And um, they got killed. Right. Yeah, because they won't serve in the army. No, they had to. Yeah, yeah. No. So they got killed and that's it. That's just for remembrance. Right. That's Napoleon War, that's a, not yeah. my time of. No. I'm not an expert in, in Napoleonic times, but. No. Yes. What happened, what happened here? That's and it, they have those in the Second World War. 
uh, they were called conscientious objectors. Yes. And yeah. they conscripted them uh, into the medical corps. Yeah. So, they, you know, they were trained as medics and yeah. stretcher bearers. Because I know. they refused to fight. Not only medical, but also repair troops. Yeah. Bicycle repair troops. Wow. So let's check out the mortars. Oh, yeah, that's big. They cannot move them, they are so big. Wow. I could stay here, my knees. Squeezing. These are mortars. And they are the same age. 1810, 1830. Wow. It's crazy. No, I would really know. I've done a bit, a lot of shit in my life, but I'm not fire up that water for no. No, I won't want to be anywhere, anywhere near that when it went off. No one these. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but not, we were fired by, by a fire Yeah. 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 And then oh. run away and. <laughs> yeah, they'll be ground shakers. So, that is the base of the building. Have a serious manhole. Oh, yeah. I'm going to go in there. The block that is. You can go inside the wall. So that way you can go to the positions as I saw you on the other yep. side with the demons. That's for fresh air, ventilation. And on that side, under the arrow, was the entrance to the ice house for the bakery. Uh -huh. All original, it's not destroyed in Second World War. That survived. There's another cave. Into the, uh, into the wall to get it to the position, there's now all the electric stuff. Uh -huh. Yeah, they have to hide that electrical stuff because that is all lifted building. Uh -huh. Ah, yes, of course. But you must not see the modern stuff, though. No. So yeah. these carriages, they're all original. Uh huh. They were horse drawn guns. Oh, wow. Yeah. There was another side there, that building. Behind that building there was a stable oh. and they pulled the horses and they pulled the guns out of it and there's a horse drawn guns inside. Now there's uh, nothing inside. Nothing. But it's all original. Right? The doors are not that old. Maybe 50 years but uh, wood yeah. will not last 300 years. No. So, Viewers, thank you so much for watching this video from Vesel, Germany. This was the Vesel Citadel. I'm Andy from ALW Research Team. Please check out our Instagram page for up to date information of where we've been and what we're doing. Because some of these videos were filmed quite some time ago. But see Instagram for real-time information.